How do you fix the timing of your guitar, your bass, and even your vocal tracks in Logic Pro for iPad without re-recording the whole thing? Well, that's what we're going to cover in this video. Let's go. To do this, we're going to be using quantization. Now, the cool thing about Logic Pro is you can quantize not only your virtual instrument tracks, but you can also quantize your audio tracks. But what is quantization and how can it help? Quantization analyzes the transients of your audio recording and then allows you to choose how to line those up on the beat. So if you've got transients that are not quite lining up, you can fix them with quantization. Here's how we get it done. Here's the project for my song called One Moment, and here's the drums and the bass track. But what you can see is if we scroll across here, this second bass note is coming in too early. Now, I could, of course, re-record that, but we can use quantization for this. At the moment, it sounds like this. It's not too bad, but it's just really, in my view, ruining the start of this song, and we're going to use quantization to fix it. So what we need to do is select this region of the bass track, come down to the bottom left and tap on the inspector, and then here is our quantization option. We can tap this one and turn it on. Now, you can line it up with whatever notes you want. I normally use something like a 16th note, because that's going to just do some little fine tuning. It's going to find the closest 16th note. So let's see if that's going to work for this track. We'll tap on that one and there you go you can see it's moved that across let's just show you that one more time I want to turn it back off again keep an eye on this section here as we turn this on and we make it 16th note again there it goes it just shimmies it a little bit to the right let's take a listen to what this sounds like now much better now you are going to get a little bit of artifacts in there sometimes because it is actually stretching out your audio so do keep that in mind it's not a perfect solution for every application but if you've just got a note or two like this it can work really well and if we bring this back in with the rest of our project you really can't tell the difference but that bass note hits right on the drum beat, which is exactly what we want. Quantization is set at the region level. So when you tap on a region in your project, you're going to see the quantization settings there, and it's going to be different for each region. If we want to select the entire track, all we need to do is tap and hold outside like this, drag across all those regions, and then we can set quantization to whatever we like for that entire track. And as you would have seen, we've got a whole bunch of options here for quantization, everything from a whole note up to a 64th note, depending on how much you need your notes to move around. You can also adjust the swing and the strength and the range. There's a heap of quantization options, which we will cover in future videos. Check the description to check out all the Logic Pro videos right here on the channel. One final tip with audio quantization, and that is that sometimes you don't want to quantize a whole region. You only want to fix a couple of notes. Well, don't worry. There's a way that we can do that. First of all, let's turn off the quantization. We'll go back to off there. And what we can actually do is we can split out this first few notes and only quantize those. So if we come in here, we'll just use our split tool, tap on the split there, drag down like so, and then we can select this as an independent region because that's the only spot where we actually really need to do anything. We'll turn our split tool off, go back to here. Remember, this is the note that we want to fix. So all we need to do now is tap on this one, go 1 16th, and there you go, it's fixed just that first note, but the rest of the track won't be quantized because I was quite happy with the way I played it. So if you want to quantize just a couple of notes, simply split those out and quantize just that region. Now, if you've got a bunch of notes that don't line up, there's really nothing better than re-recording your guitars and your vocals and your bass tracks. But in these sort of instances where there's maybe one or two notes, you just need to tighten, quantization can work really well. We've got a heap more videos all about creating in Logic Pro for iPad linked down in the description, and I'll see you on the next one.